step up real close, tell everyone your name. Hi, I'm May. May. Uh, can I see the watch? Now, is this yours? Yes. It's nice and big, which is good. You can actually read it. Uh, so it says here, it reads, I should say, 920, almost on the dot. Uh, do you agree with that? I agree. Cool. Now point to somebody in the front row that you don't know that looks trustworthy to verify the time. Anyone at random? Yes. Yeah, Who? Which one? The guy right here? Cool. Come on up here. Let's give him a round of applause as well, ladies and gentlemen. Cool. Let me shake your hand. You are? Brian, cool, I need you to just step right over here. Awesome, can you verify that it's 920, almost 21 on that watch? Yep. Okay, if you have a watch of your own and you wanna verify the time, by all means you can check. Now are you a right or left-handed, which one? Well, I put that uh, which one do you write with? Right, right, right. Your right hand. Okay, so it's 21 after approximately. You're going to make sure I don't pull the pin out of the watch. Now, it's 921. As soon as this touches your hand, you're going to squeeze it. You're going to hold it across your chest, and the object is to make sure I can't pull that out. Okay, so squeeze it just through the loop. Yep, and now hold it to your chest and put your other hand on top of it. Cool. You'll stay just like that. Uh, in fact, I'm going to ask both of you to switch places for me, please. Awesome. Now, what I'm gonna attempt to do, if possible, is affect that watch without actually touching it. Uh, a demonstration of, again, what they call psychokinesis. Make sure everybody can hear you. Um, it was May? May. May? I don't, uh, your name didn't change in the last minute? <laughs> okay, good. Uh, May, I want you to, out loud for us, uh, so that everybody can hear. I want you to say a number out loud between, let's say, 1 and 30. 12. 12. I want you to imagine I'm taking 12 minutes. I'm actually holding time. Imagine that. It's a weird concept, but imagine I can hold time in my hand. Now, uh, if you can, was it Brian? Yeah. Lean in here and into the microphone. I'd like you to say a number, again, within the same range, anywhere in the middle between 1 and 30. 8. 8. We're going to add eight more, so it was uh, tw uh, 12 and eight, that's 20, okay? I want both of you to sit absolutely as still as you possibly can for this experiment. Now, ladies and gentlemen, it was 21 after, it might be 22. By the time I finish this, it might be 23 after the hour. So again, please keep in mind that time does not stop for me, yet. <laughs> and what I'm gonna try to do is move that watch at least 20 minutes into the future without touching it. Now I want you to keep in mind, at no time will I cross this invisible line between us, okay? You see this invisible line here? You do? <laughs> You'd be amazed at how many people see the invisible line. I'm just kidding. But now, for the cool part, don't move. Now, if I've done this correctly, that watch just moved about 20 minutes into the future. It might be a minute here or there, obviously give me some leeway. I won't even get near you. Take a look and tell me if it moved about 20 minutes into the future. Yes, no, maybe so. Take a look, I won't touch it. Did it actually move? <laughs> yeah, did it move? Yeah. Show it to Brian. Brian, I won't go over there. Verify yes or no. Did it, did, I don't want to touch it, but did it move? No, it definitely did. It, no, it definitely, you scared me with the no. You, the, the, okay, now, now that you verified that it did, let me see it, because I like to see my work. Yeah, it moved just about 20 minutes into the future, ladies and gentlemen. Let's give them a round of applause for helping me out. And uh, it was 20, 21 or 22. Before you leave, since you were so nice, uh, I'll do you a favor. Hold out your hand. Take a look at the watch and tell me if it moved back to exactly where it should be. <laughs> Did it go? One more time for my two participants, ladies and gentlemen. Come on, let me shake your hand. Well done, and enjoy the rest of the show. Keep it going for Brian!